Alright, hello everybody, this is Green, I'm bringing you part 8 of my Let's Play Portal 2. Um, read this myself, so I can get my wire situated. <coughs> anyway, and... Cue vocals. The testing area is just <laughs> up ahead. The quicker you get through, the quicker you'll get your 60 bucks. Carol, are the compensation vouchers ready? Yes, yes sir, sir, Mr. Johnson. Why did I just... Who is that? What the hell is going on here? Carolyn. Wee. All right. So I can come back over here. Now fall down through here. See, I should have done this first time around, but oh well. There we go. Whee! Pick the block. And on the button, because if you ever get a block, it usually goes on the button. Now I come up here. If any of you ever noticed, um, the envir environment, environmental sounds all sound different uh, in the different stages of the game. Like uh, in the very beginning stages of the game, whenever you're in like the newer part of Aperture or the a part of Aperture that was last actually used, um, it the f ground kind of sounds nice and new and uh, okay. solid. Well, and yet here, uh, if you walk around and stuff, it kind of squeaks because it's the older part of Aperture. And then this is another achievement. You come up here, and look is a painting of Carolyn. This is the only picture of Carolyn. But yeah, that's what she looks like. That's what Gladys looked like before she got put into a robot. Yeah. That is Gladys. AKA Carol. Carolyn. Alright, let's see. That there, that there. Blue go. Oh, wait, I'm gonna do that in a second. This is about to get covered up with orange. Alright, let's try this again. Yeah, as you saw, you have to bounce. Oh, didn't work! Ugh. Constipated sounds are apparently cool. I'm cool, right? Wow, that was weird. Bounced on that gel, even though it was down there. Alright, let's aim for the center this time, and through we go, and on Great to job, victory! War hero and or Olympian. With your help, we're gonna... Hey, hello! <laughs> this on... Hey, listen up down there. That thing's called an elevator, not a bathroom. I swear I know him. Woohoo! And then the loading screens are of the old Aperture logo. And then, of course, later in the stage, it shows the newer Aperture logos, except it gets uh, crossed out and says, like, Wheatley. If you're interested in an additional $60, Wheatley something flag down a test oh, associate oh, yeah. and let them know. You could walk out of here with a hundred and twenty weighing down your bindle if you let us take you apart, put some science stuff in you, then put you back together. Good as new. Alright, now I want to go 
over there. And away we go. Whee. First, I want to see if I can get it from here. Yeah. Put some blue on the other side of that. Grab the block. Go down here. And put the block there. There, there. Um, I want to do blue. Wait, what? No, where'd my block go? What the heck? Oh yeah, that was weird. Um, reapply the blue real quick. Stay there. And blue. And there we go. Hooray! Whee! In case you're interested, there's still some positions available for that bonus opportunity I mentioned earlier. Again, uh, bonus. all you gotta do is let us disassemble you. We're not banging rocks together here. We know how to put a man back together. So, that's a complete oh, well. reassembly. New vitals, spit shine on the old ones, plus we're scooping out tumors. Frankly, you ought to be paying us. <laughs> Something about that word choice. Scooping out tumors. Makes it sound like tumors are ice cream or something and you're scooping them out. Maybe Thank that you. Was the point. I can't believe I'm thanking these people. For staggering your way through Aperture Science's propulsion gel testing, you've made some real contributions to society for a change, and for that, humanity is grateful. If you had any belongings, please pick them up now. We don't want old newspapers and sticks cluttering up the building. For many of you, I realize $60 is an unprecedented windfall, so don't go spending it all on, I don't know, Carolyn, what do these people buy? Tattered hats? Beard dirt? Beard dirt. Is that what he said? Beard dirt? Carolyn, 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 why do Beard I know dirt. this woman? Can I kill her? Or Oh my god. Look, OMG. you're doing a great job. Can you handle things for yourself for a while? I need to think. <laughs> Welcome to the oh, Enrichment Center. Are fun. <coughs> Since making test participation mandatory for all employees, the quality of our test subjects has risen dramatically. Employee retention, however, <laughs> has not. Uh, oh, <coughs> As a result, thinking. you may have heard we're going to phase out human oh, testing. Oh no, I'm stuck in a loop. To wrap up, though. The bean counters told me we literally could not afford to buy seven dollars worth of moon rocks, much less seventy million. Bought them anyway. Ground them up, mixed them into a gel. And guess what? Ground up moon rocks are pure poison. I am deathly ill. Still, it turns out they're a great portal conductor. So now, we're going to see if jumping in and out of these new portals can somehow leach some moon poison out of man's bloodstream. I might give you lemons, make lemonade. 
Let's all stay positive and do some science. That said, I would really appreciate it if you could test as fast as possible. Carolyn, please bring me more pain pills. Sake is a great choice because you can take a lemon and once your sake is warm, go ahead and uh, squeeze your lemon uh, into your sake and then you have lemon sake, but then you take halves of the lemon that you just squeezed and you use them as glasses for your, uh, for your sake. You drink the sake out of your empty lemon halves. It's actually really good because you, you know, once you warm it up, and you know oh, I need to. Once you get it nice and warmed up, it tastes really good with the lemon. Of course, uh, most liquors taste good with some sort of acid added in or citric acid, I should specify. Got some frame rate issues right here. Life gives you lemons. Don't make lemonade. Make life take the lemons back. Get mad. I don't want your damn lemons. What am I supposed to do with these? Demand to see life's manager. Make life rule the day. It thought it could give Cave Johnson lemons. Do you know who I am? I'm the man who's gonna burn your house down with the lemons. I'm gonna get my engineers to invent a combustible lemon that burns your house down. <laughs> The point is, if we can store music on a compact disc, why can't we store a man's intelligence and personality on one? So I have the engineers figuring that out now. Brain mapping. Artificial intelligence. We should have been working on it 30 years ago. And I will say this, and I'm gonna say it on tape so everybody hears it a hundred times a day. If I die before you people can pour me into a computer, I want Carolyn to run this place. <laughs> Now she'll argue. She'll say she can't. She's modest okay, like that, but you make her. <laughs> make her! Put her in my okay. computer, I don't care. Alright, test's over. <laughs> you can head on back to your desk. Goodbye, sir. This is a fun part because I like doing those uh, parts where I'm flying through the air and such. It's quite fun. Anyway, this is gonna be the part uh, end of part eight of my Let's Play Portal 2, and I'm Green, so I'll catch you guys next time.